Hey, my G3 family, welcome back to Goddess Guidance. And to all my new viewers, thank you so, 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 so much for tuning in. Welcome to Goddess Guidance. My name is Jasmine, but you can call me the Lemurian Goddess. And I'm here to bring you guys the weekend wine. Yeah, we're going to tap into this weekend energy and see what's going on. All right, we're going to see what's happening, what's taking place. All right, um, as I was tapping into the energy, I got a couple of messages. All right, I got a lot of messages, to be honest. <laughs> so we're gonna get into these cards, but but first I got to get into what what came for me, okay? <laughs> so as I was tapping into this energy, I said, Mother, what's going on this weekend? What's going on with my G3 family, okay? Um, Earth Warriors. She said, This is who I'm addressing this weekend. I'm addressing Earth Warriors. Um, uh, uh, those in the army of mother, the remnant, the chosen, if you know, you want to say that because many are called, but few are chosen. So those chosen few, I'm talking to my earth warriors. You know, I've been, because this, the, this song popped in my head too. And I've been getting, I've been getting a lot of Karen Clark shared songs. I love her, but this is like old, old gospel. So I don't know if somebody has like old um, church roots or, or, you know, your family is just, you know, really into Christianity or whatever. It's, it's, it's like, but this is like old gospel music I'm hearing. But um, it's the safest place in all the world is in the will of God. The safest place. In all the world, but but it was it, it was just the first part that I heard. <clears throat> now that I think about it, it was just the safest place in all the world is in the will of God. In the will of God, my earth warriors, understand the safest place for you to be right now is in your unlimited power. The safest place for you to be right now is in your unlimited, ultimate power. That's in your knowing. In your divinity. In your divine incarnation. That's the safest place for the earth warriors right now. When I said, mother, what's going on with my family? She showed me a horse. A horse. Somebody is moving towards you fast. I don't know if it's you moving towards somebody fast or somebody is moving towards you fast. But somebody's moving towards you. And I said, okay, so who is moving towards my G3 and I, I looked over and at the bottom of the deck. Oh, I didn't even pick it up. That's so I, I swear to everything. I did not pick it up. I didn't see the King of Swords because I just looked over and I saw the the Six of Cups, but in reverse. So the Six of Cups is, is like, you know, past um, lovers or past life connections or just, you know, people, places, things from your past, um, childhood things. Uh, but it's, 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 it's past stuff, right? So somebody from your past is galloping back to you. And it's so funny because now that I pick it up and I see the King of Swords under there, boom, bang. I said, I saw a horse. <laughs> and the horse was galloping. This is what I saw. <laughs> Love you, mother. Love you. Um, so the past is galloping back, right? I'm talking to my earth warriors. Understand this is important. Your past for force or you can be the past of somebody going full force towards that however this is playing out for you or resonating all right um this is a general reading it's not going to resonate with everybody but that's okay you can always book with your sis we go deeper into your energy and see what mother wants to tell you please like share and subscribe yo i'll be forgetting that right please like share and subscribe let's grow the channel but anyway back to the message so, 
it's important, Earth Warriors, to understand that your past is going to come back to you. They're going to, but there's some things about the past that you need to understand. Something about this past that has been doing black magic since December. Since December of 2021, somebody has been partaking in, in some black magic. They have been, you know, either actually doing magic or burning stuff and or somebody could just be trying to really stop you and, and with, like they're really a blockage in your life right but it's like they've been this blockage since december they've been trying to block you since december something about very scandalous something hidden feelings it's, this is what's coming back to you something scandalous okay something that had hidden feelings and hidden motives this is what's galloping back to you to whoever they didn't have good intentions for you since december they're coming back mm. i did see something about a sacred union though so I don't know if you keep going towards a sacred union, like you 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 leave the past behind. We're gonna get deeper into these cards and see what's going on, okay? But I don't know if this is keep going, moving from the past, because I feel like that's something that I'm always telling my family, right? That we have to leave the past behind. It's time to move forward. It's time to go towards our new, towards what's 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 um, destined for us, right? This is for my earth warriors. You know if I'm talking to you, you know if there's a, a greater call on your life, if there's something, you know, that you want to do, you want to change something, you know that there's something great about you. You know that you didn't come here to be quiet. You know that you came here to be heard. You came here to be seen. You came here to make some type of change in whatever, you know, what it, whatever way you have because, you know, everybody has a gift. So whatever gift, you know, that, that you have that you express, this 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 uh this passion or this purpose of yours you know that it's a, it's something powerful it's something that's that's that that is promoting change i'm sorry if you can't hear me too because something's going on with my phone the service everything is bugging over here everything is bugging out <laughs> i'm like yo how do i turn this frequency down because i feel like you know my frequency went up and once that happened everything went bananas all right <laughs> So I'm sorry if you can't really hear me. It's kind of late too, so I'll try to talk a little louder. But um, yeah, something about keep going, okay. Um, also she wanted me she wanted me to look up the moon cycle, what moon cycle it was. So I looked it up, and you know we it just it was like the full moon cycle and then the gibbous moon, right? So she wanted me to look at the gibbous moon. So it, she, <clears throat> I, I I took some notes a while ago of, on the moon cycle. So you know, your girl be in here getting to it. I be trying to understand what's going on. <laughs> Real talk. <laughs> so anyway, the gibbous moon is the final step to completion. The pen the penultimate the penultimate the penultimate. I really had to look this word up and, and, and you know, how do you, how you press the, the voice thing so they can pronounce it for you. Penultimate step. So the next to last or the second to last step. It's heavy. Grab it. Pregnant energy that is almost entirely right. It's very, very, very rich. Discerning. It's analyzing. Mother said, prepare and trust. This is what this moon is saying. Prepare and trust is a pivotal point in a cycle. The question that the gibbous moon is asking you, what details have I overlooked? The whole picture cannot be seen. Therefore, your knowledge is incomplete. Therefore, you have to trust the cycle. Therefore, you have to trust your intuition. Therefore, you have to trust this power this knowing within you, this wisdom within you. This is the final step. You're right there. You're right there. You're right there. You was about to give up, but mother is telling you, do not give up. 
keep going. Okay, this is what this keep going is saying. Somebody was about to give up, but you cannot give up. You have to keep going. See, something probably is trying to come back from your past to slow you down, to stop you. But mother is saying, this is the final step. This is the final test. Are you going to pass the test? It's a test. You're in a test this weekend. This weekend is about a test. Ooh. I love it. Mother wants to know, are you going to pass the test? See, the question that this moon is asking you today, tomorrow, this weekend is, what details have I overlooked? What have I missed? I missed something. See, somebody might come back and you might be trying to gravitate to it, but you're missing something. See, you don't have the full picture. You don't have the full, it says, it says, the whole picture cannot be seen. You can't see everything right now on a 3D level, but you have intuition. You have a knowing. Mother wants you to trust your gut. What is your, are you going to trust your gut this weekend? Are you going to trust the knowing? Because in the 3D sense, you don't have the full picture. The full picture is, is scandalous. The full picture is, is some type of black magic that was being done. The full picture is somebody is trying to come back and block you. The full picture is this is a test. Are you going to pass the test? Are you going to overlook what's been done to you? What this energy has done to you? What these people have done to you? How they have um, had not seen you, played you, whatever they did to you. Are you going to overlook this? The talking about you behind your back that you know. The trying to stop you that you know. See, there's a lot of things that you know, but you're overlooking. So mother's saying, what details? The moon is saying, what details? Yeah, the moon is mother energy. So I got you. Mother's saying, what details have you overlooked? You overlooked them. Meaning that you've seen them. <laughs> you know how something right there, you just, 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 just. <laughs> you see it, but you overlooking it. You, you, <laughs> you, huh? What happened? <laughs> you overlooking something that's right there. What details are you overlooking? Are you going to pass the test this weekend? I love it. I love it, mother. I thank you so much. But breaking that down because I don't know. I just was like, I, I got the paper, I got what was what was being said, and I put it together with you guys right here, right now. So thank you for that, mother. Thank you for the messages that has already come through. What else do you want to tell my beautiful G3 family? Yeah, they've been overlooking something, but it's time for you to see what you're overlooking so you can make the correct choice, so you can pass this test, so you can move forward. Yeah, G3 is all about forward motion. Don't come here if you're not looking to move forward. That means moving forward means you got to leave some things behind. One thing about my G3 family, it, we do have a hard time leaving stuff behind. It, it, it really, it's hard for us because of the heart that we have. I really, I talk about this all the time. We have beautiful hearts, right? Right? Um, we love. And, and when we love, it's, it's not no little love. Like, we really love you. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, 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 it's all love. <laughs> we really want the best for you. So you really, you, you um, form attachments very quickly. Yeah, so having to learn who and what to attach yourself to was a big part of your healing journey, or not even, just the journey in general. You had to learn that, but it was definitely part of the healing process. But at the end of the day, Mother is saying, keep, keep going. Keep going. The best is yet to come. Your ladder will be greater than your past. I'm telling you, a lot of gospel. I've been listening. It's a lot of gospel. I'm hearing it. The dream walker. Dreams. The collective good. Illusions. Number eight. The rainbow prince. Compensation. Perseverance. 26. Eight, ooh, eight, eight. Mm, abundance, abundance. Your compensation. Got you, mother. The web weaver. 
synchronicity, divine intelligence, cause and effect, or one more, thank you, sun dancer, joyful activity, celebration of life, abundance, did I say abundance, 32, 5, 4, 5, progression, yeah, keep going, keep going, the chess queen, Ah, strategic. Mm. Mm. You know what I'm getting with that? Somebody is being very strategic when it comes to you, my G3 family. Somebody is being very, very strategic. I'm getting two. It's two people being very strategic. See, the Earth Warrior is being strategic and the Path. And, and whoever is galloping on this horse is being very strategic. Mm, you're playing chess. You're playing chess. Trust, strategizing. Yeah, somebody is strategizing. Oh, three, four, five. Yeah, somebody is strategizing. Somebody's in the process of moving forward, of leaving something behind. Yeah, you're in the process of leaving something. You got your back turned to something. You got your back turned to something. I'm seeing some type of Masonic connection. I'm seeing some type of, uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Masonry. Some type of, yeah, Masonry connection. Occult. Maybe occult knowledge or just some type of occult. You can be turning your back to an occult. You can be turning your back to a, um, a group of people. Somebody is being strategic and leaving something, someone, or a group of people behind. See, the past is running back to you, but you have your back turned to it. You have your back turned to it. Look at your back. You got your back turned to something. The dream walker. I'm seeing it's like you're you're leaving behind illusions. See, I feel like the past is trying to bring some type of illusion towards you. Um, but you're leaving these illusions. You're moving towards abundance. You're moving towards your dreams. See, the thing about it is you are a dreamer. You you are a daydreamer and a night dreamer. You know what I'm saying? You're it's like you really use your mind to create your reality. You really understand the power of the mind. You, you know that in order to bring forth what you want, you have to really see it. And you created your, yes, you have a, a, a vast imagination. You can, you know, you can be sitting in one place and your mind is, I don't know, somewhere in Italy, somewhere in France. You know what I'm saying? You, you, or you created something so amazing in your mind that sometimes you don't even... It's like, damn, I gotta come back to reality. <laughs> that's how that's how much and how vast and how big your your mind is. You 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 dream big. I gotta dream big. Cause when it happens, it's gonna happen real quick. Yeah, I feel it. Some yeah, somebody is dreaming big. And no, they're no longer being stuck in illusions. This is what's going on. Somebody is, is walking towards their dream. They're walking towards their calling. They're walking towards their destiny. Earth warriors, you are walking towards what is what is yours. You're walking towards your, you know, your destiny. You're walk oh snap. You're walking towards love. You're walking towards real love, true love, new love. Yeah. This weekend, you're walking towards new love. You're no longer dealing with the past. You said I'm good on that. The collective is good. <laughs> the collective good. <laughs> the collective good. Right. The collective good. Like, you like, I'm good on that. I'm good on all of these illusions. I'm good on everything that you're trying to show me. I'm good on all of that. Like, like I feel like 
I feel like you were okay. You were you were strategizing at one point with with the past, or or because I feel like something about December. You've been dealing with this since since December, or or you know around that time. But it's like you know, it's like you're tired of you know strategizing with with whatever. It's like you're good on that. You're trusting your dreams. You're trusting this 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 vision that you have. You're no longer stuck in illusions. Okay, and and the past is is. And, oh, okay, and because you're no longer, because the, it's the Rainbow Prince that's next. I feel like the past is upset, but it's like you get, you get compensated because you, you learned the lesson. I feel like it was a lesson in whatever was going on with you and the past. It was some type of lesson that needed to be learned. This is why this weekend is like, what details are you overlooking? Because it's like, it's something about this past that's going to, you know, it's like, it's a, it's, it's a, some type of final test. You know, it's a final test. This is the, the, the last step. You know what I'm saying? The last, the last step before the last, you know, it's like, you're, you're right there. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you gotta, you gotta pass this, 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 this point right here. You got to. All right. And I feel like you're in an energy like I'm passing it. Like I'm not dealing with it. My back is turned to it. I'm not doing this no more. And because of that, you're being con co compensated. You're, you're, um, um, it's like the rainbow prince. It's like the, the treasure at the end of the rainbow. You know what I'm saying? It's like you get to the end of the rainbow. You, you're, if, if you, if you pass the final test, you, now you can get the gold at the end of the rainbow. See, you are the golden child. You are supposed to shine this month. You are supposed to be bright this month. You are supposed to be walking in your full power this month. You sh you you are supposed to be walking in your in in, in your um, um your boldness, like in, in all of who you are and everything that you that 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 comes with you. You are supposed to be walking in that happily with no fear of what anybody is saying. This is your month to really shine, to really bring forth the new, to really bring in what this year, what 2002 has been meant for you. This is the weekend for you to do that. But is, are you going to pass the test that also comes in the month of August, that also comes in this month for you? Are you going to pass this? last test in August that, that that's going to um, determine if you are the golden child. See, you, you are the golden child, but if you don't pass these tests, you can really dim your light, dim your shine, dim, you know, or, or I don't know, some lose some type of value. You, you can do these things. Everything is free will. That's the beauty of life, free will, making your own choices, making your own decisions, but understanding with these choices and with these decisions comes repercussions. Whatever you do, consequences. People are scared of that word. Because that word is just, it's just, it just means the reaction to an action. It's a consequence. Whatever you do has a consequence, no matter what. So I feel like this, 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 this month, this, this test that you have to pass is going to really decide. Are you the real golden child? Are you the real earth warrior? Are you the real you? But I feel like my G3 family, you passed the test. You're going to pass this test. That's what I feel like. I feel like you're, because your back is turned to the illusions. You're no longer stuck in illusions. You're no longer stuck because some type of spell work has been broken. Thank you, mother. Something has been broken off of you. It can no longer hold you. Something had you bound to them. You have broke free. My G3. And guess what? Now you get compensated because you turned your back to the illusion. Now you get the gold that's at the end of the rainbow. The web weaver. 
synchronicities, divine intelligence, cause and effect, ah, action, reaction, cause and effect, how you move, how it's, how, have, however you move, it's how life is going to move. However you move, are you going to follow the synchronicity? Ah, do you see it? I just want to put it up there. I don't want people to think I'm making things up. Do you see it? Maybe I'm tapped in. <laughs> the synchronicities. Are you going to follow the synchronicities? You have divine intelligence. You, you, you have, you, you have a support system. You have the cheat codes. You understand that the cheat codes is just you, your intuition, your knowing. You have that. You have that divine intellect, that divine intel you have it are you going to follow it this month are you going to follow it this weekend my g3 family because cause and effect is real important see whatever you do is what life is going to do ah when i move you move just like that that's how it goes when i move you move just like that when i move you move so when you move life is going to move however you move is how life is going to move are you moving yourself into destruction or are you going to move yourself towards happiness towards your abundance ah, it's a lot of abundance this weekend it's a lot of things that's that, that a lot of happiness success fulfillment joy celebration because that's the next card the sun dancer joyful activity celebration of life abundance it's a lot of abundance a lot of progression it's a lot for you on the path of righteousness on the path of self awareness self fulfillment self love self what is self telling you this weekend is so important it's a test it's a test it's a test it's a test she want me to pull from these moon cards it's a test you're meant to dance Maybe somebody's going out this weekend. Somebody went out this weekend. Somebody's having a good time this weekend. I feel like it's a lot of celebration this weekend, okay? I feel like it's a lot of happiness this weekend. And it's because you passed the test. Because you made the right choice. Because you did the right thing. Because you, because the, the collective good. Because you, I'm like, I'm following, you following your dreams, right? I'm following my dreams. I'm good. I'm good on that. I'm good on you. I'm good on, I'm good on all of that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Heard you. Heard you, sis. Heard you, bro. I'm good on all of that. Yeah, yeah, I get I get you. Nah, for real, for real. And, and, and I feel you. It's like I get you and I feel you. Nah, for real, I understand. But I'm good. <laughs> I love it, G3. That's how I feel. I feel like you're like, I'm good. Mm. Right, 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 right. Right, right. Now nah, you're right. You absolutely correct. Yeah, I feel like somebody not somebody don't want to argue no more. You absolutely correct. You right. I'm good on that. The collective good. <laughs> I love you, mother. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. Look, 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 look. Expect powerful change. I love you, mother. I listen. I, I listen. I listen. I listen to my intuition. Okay. I listen. To, they, they said pull for the moon, moon, moonology deck. Okay. Expect powerful change. This is the energy. Something is pregnant. Something. Something. It's like your water is about to break. This is why the past is coming back. This is probably why past energies is coming back. This is why, because your water is about to break. You're, you're about to really come into, you're right there on the brink of greatness, on the brink of happiness, on the brink of success. You can expect powerful change. You can expect 
whatever is coming towards you, your, your expectation is, is even calling forth it because you are, it's like you, you, you're no longer stuck. You, you, you're following your dreams. You're following this vision. You're following the mission. You're following the goal. You're following the pull of the gut of the knowing of the intuition. You're following it and you can expect powerful change because of that. Clap, clap, bravo. You're in the right spot. Nothing has gone wrong. You're in the right, you're, you're right where you're supposed to be. You're going through this or whatever you're going through or whatever you're, you're in this weekend or whatever you're facing this weekend, you're going through it because it's only a test. Are you ready and are you prepared for this next level? Are you, are you prepared to be the golden child? Are you prepared to be in the spotlight? Are you prepared to be seen? Are you prepared to be among the masses? Are you prepared to be praised? Are you prepared to be honored? Are you prepared to be re revered? I feel like there is some, it's some, Something is going to be in the spotlight. You're going to be seen. Are you prepared for this? This is this is preparation. Mother wants to make sure you are prepared. See, she's not going to put you into something that you're not prepared for. That's the beauty of the divine. The divine wants what's best for you. They're not going to put you into anything that you are not ready for because they don't want you to mess this up. They don't want you to mess up your destiny. They don't want you to mess up your, your mission. They don't want you to mess up your purpose. This is what you came here. This is what you signed up for. They don't want you to do that. So they're going to make sure before they even put you in, in, in the next position and not even they, we can look at it as yourself because before you even can get to the next level, you have to do everything that you need to do. You had to learn every lesson. You had to apply everything that you've learned before you can move to the next level. So you don't mess it up. And that's just, it, it just is what it is. That's how this thing goes. That's how you break cycles, learning the lesson and applying them. People want to move on to the next level, but you had to apply the lesson that you learned. And mother, this is, and I feel like this is the test. What are you overlooking? Because are you applying the lesson? You are not applying the lesson that you've learned. You've learned it. You've learned it. You've learned. You have learned G3, but are you applying what you have learned? Because if you apply what you have learned, then you wouldn't be overlooking what you need to be staring dead at so you can make the right choice and get this gold at the end of the rainbow. It's time for you to be comp compensated because of your perseverance, because you didn't give up. Because it's, it's, you, you didn't give up in life. Life, life was bow, 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 whooping your ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. But life had to. Life had to whoop your ass. I'm getting stubborn energy. I could be talking to a Taurus. The bull, stubborn. Life whooping your ass. Mr. or Mrs. Know-it-all, right? I'm going to do it my way. It's my way or the highway. You've been outside on, a, on many of highways. Because people are like, what are you talking about? <laughs> okay, your way on the highway. All right, well, they go I-95. Okay, go ahead, do your fizzies. <laughs> life was whooping your ass, but life was teaching you lessons. Life was teaching you a lot of lessons. And I feel like no matter what type of lesson, no matter what type of hurdle, no matter what type of blow life um, 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 delivered you, you kept going. You fought back. You never stopped. You never failed. You never broke. Ooh. Ooh, I got chills. You never broke. A lot of things wanted to bend you in life and you can point fingers at people. Oh, you did this or you did that or you did that. But at the end of the day, when you get down to the nitty gritty of this whole thing, it was life teaching you it was the womb it was the mother it was you making sure you learned these lessons so that you can apply them and live the life that you have come here to live abundance you are here to be abundant you are not here to be impoverished understand this my g3 family you are breaking the chains of poverty that means that you have to break free from the impoverished. Yeah, it's a lot of people that, that's still in this poverty mindset around you. But mother is saying you got to get away from the poverty in order to go to, towards your abundance. Mother wants you to move towards your abundance, but you still stuck in some type of poverty with some type of impoverished ass people. 
No, no, no. Not my G3. Not you. You don't belong nowhere where poverty is present. And it just is what it is. If poverty is there, you are there to break it down. You are there to whoop poverty's ass. You are an earth warrior. You are here to break the chains. The change of poverty is what gets people in better positions in life, is what change the outcome of your family, of your bloodline. You're here to change the outcome. Expect powerful change. See, you were the powerful change that your ancestors expected. You were the dream. Got you. You are the dream walker. You are the dream walker. You are the dream. They dreamed of you. They thought of you. They, 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 they prayed for you. You can no longer let the past hold you back because they prayed for you. The, 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 the prayers of your ancestors is what's empowering you right now. Mother is saying this is why the, the safest place in all the world is in the will of God. It's in the prayers of your ancestors. It's in your power. Woo! You were the change. And it's here for you to be that change, to remain that change, to really walk in that change. Confidence is key to your success. Confidence is key to your success. It's right over the collective good. The collective good. Confidence is, is the success to your, it's the key to your success. You have to be bold in your decision. It's no longer, oh, listen, that's so funny. So why are you talking to me? Like, can you just talk to the family? <laughs> because as I talk to you, I talk to me. You have, we have to learn how to let the past go, right? Oh my goodness. It's no longer, oh, it's no longer the illusion. It's no longer the excuse. It's no time for that. It's no time for the excuses anymore. Confidence is key to your success. Success is the only thing that should be on your mind. Success in every area of your life. This weekend, it, success is abundance wants to come towards you. We see the A. We see the three, four, five. We see the progression. We see the abundance, the joyful celebration of life, the sun dancer. Yeah, confidence is key. New moon and Leo. Somebody probably somebody here's a Leo. You have you have a road. <laughs> what? Yo, did I just growl? That's funny. Where did I just even come from? <laughs> I thought you know. Okay, you have a row. <laughs> it's like mm, you got a you got a fire in you. You got a you got a fire and a boldness in you that want to come out. And I feel like whatever I feel like the past is is, is, is maybe the past is bringing some type of rattle. Like you like like you want to fight. Maybe you want to. It's like that's how much you want to let you you want to be go, like ah you ready to fight. Or maybe somebody's ready to fight you. Oh, the past want to fight you. The past don't want the past wants you to stay stuck in the illusion. I'm telling you, they want to fight you. They want to fight you. Your dreams need a practical plan. See, like I said, you've been planning for you've been planning, you've been weaving your life in, 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 in divine order. Oh. I feel like your whole your whole life is like it's divine it's, it's ordered. Your steps are ordered. Look at that. Don't let your past hold you back. <laughs> ah, telling you. I'm telling you. I don't even want to say anything else. It's like, don't let your past hold you back. The South knows. That's, 
that all that old shit it, it was comfortable because it's the past mother wants you to go towards the, what, what makes you uncomfortable yeah go towards what makes you uncomfortable because whatever makes you uncomfortable is what's going to bring you that abundance whatever is is, is because the, the 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 north node is is where you need to be okay and the north node is what is what brings you is like what breaks you out of that that comfort zone it it, it, it puts you into some you know in, in, in an arena that you're not really used to you know it's like you're you're probably really good at what whatever you do or really but it's like you know it's it's it's, it's kind of uncomfortable in the beginning you gotta it's the north node you gotta get used to in your next life your north node is going to be your south node that's how this thing go okay so your 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 south node feels feels good. The past feels good. Yeah, you need to be in a, an abundant energy. But it's upside down. The past is, can no longer the past no longer serves you. The past keeps you in 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 some type of um. What is this? The nine of pentacles. The nine of pentacles is abundance, but it's in reverse. The past like depletes you. Okay. And you're you're not to you're not to be depleted. You're not supposed to be depleted. So anyway, like I was saying, the, the, the past is comfortable because it's your south node, but don't let the past hold you back. Mother wants you to keep going for real. For real. And 40 minutes. All right, listen. Yeah, let me just clarify some messages. If yeah, somebody somebody wants to look at that. Look at that. The seven of the seven of swords and an eight of pentacles. Look at that. I feel like whoever whoever was in the past was just playing a lot of games. I'm telling you, it's deceit. A lot of deceit. A lot of they were taken from you. They were stealing from you. Okay. Um, this this energy is up all night thinking about how how to manifest you back. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm the magician. That's a, that's some magic. There's some magic going on. I'm telling you, the Queen of Wands. But you're protected. See, you have you have a lot of protection around you. So. No matter what, I feel like you're you're in a position to make the right decisions and do what you need to do because of this protection, because of this guidance. I don't want you to really listen to that. She don't want you to pass. She don't want the past to hold you back. I'm just gonna end it off with the um, divine feminine, and that's it. Because okay, <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you got anything from this message, you wanna leave your girl a donation. Everything is down below. I love you guys so, 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 so much. Um, I know you guys will pass the test, okay? Because you are the true earth warrior. You are the true golden child, okay? And you will succeed in life. The Buddha of enlightened action. My soul informs my every step. I do what my heart compels me to do. The green tower. It's time to really trust this intuition. Your soul, okay? Your soul is trying to tell you where to go. Your heart is... is, 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 is pulling you and leading you in directions that that is is best for you so trust it in in whatever it is this is why i love this i love this because it was it's like in whatever it's relationships you know um um just family uh work at um aspects it's like whatever is making you happy whatever you know um is is bringing you peace mm. Mm, Lilith. okay hey sis i'm the voice of my body I choose the life that I desire to live. There we go. You choose the life that you desire to live. Mother's saying go towards peace in every aspect of your life. Whatever is not bringing you peace is truly here to keep you off your path. And that's facts. Love you guys. Thank you again. And until next time.